What is up, you guys? CC Clemens, aka Vibing Weirdo. Hope you're doing well. I'm doing great. I had no idea that I would be dropping a movie review for this. But before we get started, I just want y'all to know that spooky season, I'm here for it. Okay? You see it. It's lit. I know that's dope, right? That's crazy. I like to show off things that are cool. Coraline, don't play with them. But yeah, I just wanted to show y'all that. I thought that was so cool. I'm ready. Halloween, let's do it. Yeah! This was definitely another great way to get the vibe started before October even hits. We had scary movies come out this month. We had The Nun 2 and It Lives Inside. I'm not going to talk about that. And then we have a lot more coming out in October. So I'm super, super stoked and excited. Um, yeah, so I, I, I had not heard of this movie at all. Movie Time Minute, he dropped a review to it that I didn't watch. And Chris Stuckman dropped a movie review to it. And I was like, whoa, these two guys dropped a review to a Hulu movie? I gotta check it out. Because the title alone probably wouldn't have made me want to just click on it, especially on a Hulu original movie. But I was very quickly corrected. This is pretty much an alien movie. And alien movies are hit or miss. The majority of alien movies I've watched, I don't like. They usually follow the same like plot storyline and it's played out or by the, when you see the aliens, it's like bad effects, bad visuals, CGI, all of that stuff. And I mean, when you think of the concept of aliens, some plot structures are going to be the same for the most part, like invasion coming over to invade and now we want to take over your planet because we need to live here because we want to conquer, whatever, right? But that's where this movie stands out. There was so much more depth added to this that I was not expecting. And it comes down to Bryn's character. No spoilers at all, um, by the way, for this review, but there are some things we learn about her. We're trying to figure out about her that adds more depth. Um, in life to the character and to the, the movie as a whole. It's not just an old alien invasion movie. Like I was personally invested in Bryn's character and really was ruined for her throughout this whole alien invasion journey. <laughs> in my opinion, the movie was very well directed and the effects were really nice. They weren't perfect. You could definitely like tell like this isn't super duper real, but I think considering the budget that they worked with on this and what I've seen at theaters, this was really good. They definitely didn't try to overdo it and that worked very well with this movie. Yeah, they looked creepy. I didn't like it and it, it just, there was a lot of moments where I was like, ugh, this feels so weird to even be able to witness. I, I had not seen the trailer for this. If you're looking for a scary movie, like to have jump scares and all of that, unless you're terrified of aliens, you're probably not gonna get that with this. Um, this is more of a spooky movie creepy more of a thriller than anything caitlin dever she played bridge she did a fantastic job she was able to really carry this film there were some really great shots some slow motion effects that are really nice and even seeing like just the aliens <laughs> even saying that just sounds weird but seeing them like just like their technology and what they do how they do it their abilities was really freaking dope it was one scene in particular i was just like wow that is awesome i personally didn't love how the movie ended but it did make sense it was satisfactory enough to be like, hey, that was a great movie. I could just step back and say, that was a great movie, even with the way it ended. I get it. So yeah, overall, this is definitely one of the best alien movies I've seen in a while. The last one I saw that really just blew my mind was Nope. I don't really want to compare the two because just a lot more <laughs> budgeting and marketing was put in, into Nope. But what I liked most about this is when it came to the just the action and the, the thrilling element of it, they dove right in. Nope was more of a slow burner which was very, very much worth the wait. But that's what I liked about this. And before Nope, I can't tell you the last Alien movie that I love because that's just not my bag. That's not something that I'm, I'm crazy about or really love. So it has to be really good and, and entertaining for me to be like, you know what? I like this movie. Now, the only thing I didn't like, there were a few like parts of the story I didn't love. Like I just wanted like maybe more explanation for certain things to kind of have things connect, to have more of an understanding of what was going on. But even even with that, I I I was like, wow, this is the best movie I saw all weekend. Like I went to the movies twice this weekend and this was the best one I saw in my house. And the best movie I've seen in a minute. The Nun 2 was amazing. Yeah, outside of that, just like a alien type movie. Like this was, this was, I loved it. And I know there's some other people that had like completely opposite feelings, but I really love this movie. It captured what it needed to capture well enough for me to enjoy it. So um, yeah, overall, I would give this movie an A. A few things could have been tightened up with the plot or the story. This was a really dope movie and I would highly recommend it. Again, if you're not into this kind of stuff, you're probably not going to like it. But if you're willing to give it a try and you already have Hulu, absolutely would go for it.
all right so those are my thoughts let me know yours in the comments definitely want to know how you guys feel about it if you watched it no spoilers uh, that's that's important but um yeah I, I would love to know your thoughts i love this i had a great time i had a great time with this and i'm like you know what this inspired me to watch more hulu original movies because this was pretty dang good don't forget to like and subscribe drink your water have a great day peace sure you can.